Western Thunder to fight Wyoming fight. Ladies and gentlemen, to honor America, the Star Spangled Banner. It's nice. It, it, it's uh, yeah, nothing out of the ordinary. We emphasize it, and it happens in the games. 
play fast early, get get on top early, and uh, you know that kind of creates the mojo and gets it going for the game. How do you feel this time to kind of keep that that mojo going as opposed to you know Virginia Tech obviously came back on you. If you guys just kind of continue that early success, how important was that? Certainly, yeah, yeah, we, we were able to keep it going a little bit better than we did week once. Uh, you know, typical week two, you make strides after week one. You know, we're getting better at those things. Defense got a few turnovers. That, that obviously, had, you know, momentum and, and things yeah. get get a big boost from that. Yeah, turnovers with the defense. It's, you know, it creates momentum. It creates things, short fields, and we're able to get some points out quickly. Talk about the flea flicker a little bit. That's not a play you guys have used a lot of. Yeah, we haven't ran one of those. So uh, pulled it out and uh, you know, it turned out pretty well. You uh, you get to see much of that play? <laughs> no, I, I didn't see it. So. Uh, don't ask me about the end. <laughs> <laughs> what did Austin say on the sidelines though? Was he looked pretty disappointed not to be in that count? Well, was apparently there's a guy right behind him and they had to avoid. So that's, all, <laughs> that's all I heard. <laughs> Another good game for Doug. This time, you know, when he's able to contribute out there, this is a really tough run today. Yeah, very physical running back. Doug does a great job. You know, he just gets positive yards every play. Uh, you know, it might not be the big play every time, but it's you know, consistent. Four or five, you know, and then bust out a couple tens, and it's nice. Look like he's doing a better job in the passing game, too, getting him the ball receiving as well. Yeah, yeah, I think that's big for the running backs. They get more comfortable catching the ball, getting the uh, getting it out in the pass routes, and uh, that's an advantage for us. You got you go against all those young defensive linemen, and it seemed like with Shea out today and Winter Swag not 100%, those guys really, really played a big role. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, they're, uh, they're doing a great job. Hey, are you getting anything? Sorry. Uh, <laughs> what about your overall just uh, I'm, I'm feeling sorry. about moving forward into the season? Yeah, just how I good does it feel coming out with the victory? It's victor? nice. Uh, we're two weeks into this, and uh, really after this point, it really gets into true thing, the true deal, because uh, after this, really a week by week basis. Uh, you know, we, we kind of had the Virginia Tech thing, then a little break, and then this. So uh, we're into the real thing now. Sounds like game day ABC this week. Uh, you guys have been through this a lot with the hype, but <laughs> what, what does that mean, you think, to Boise State to, to have those two things attached to your program that, that haven't been before? Hey, it sounds awesome. Uh, people are excited about us. People are uh, looking forward to this game, and we're playing a good opponent. Uh, I think that's the big thing that people want to see both these teams play. How much do you enjoy the country talking about you guys? I think it means people care about us. They think we're playing some good football, and uh, you know whatever that conversation is, we just take care of our business, and uh, the other people deal with that. Does it ever become a detriment, and is that indicative? Watching what Austin Pettis may have uh, just joyfully been expressing. <laughs> I, uh, anything outside of us, it really doesn't get to us. Once we're inside the football offices, and, you know, doing doing the football thing, we got so much business to take care of. We don't really worry about this. When you get a game in hand, though, how much does style points of concern to you guys? Do you guys want to look good and finish well, and is that a big deal to you guys? Oh, I think they're style points, but they're not necessarily for the nation. It's for us to feel like we're taking care of business. We're able to uh, execute the way we want to. Uh, you know, you still got to come out in the second court, so there's second half. Uh, you know, get some points on the board, get that momentum going, because uh, certainly there's going to be other games in the future where uh, we're going to have to come back and uh, make some plays. Talk about the way the offensive line played tonight. Seemed like they, they really dominated that matchup. Yeah, great job. Uh, plenty of time back there. And uh, those big boys just doing a great job. Kellen, early in the game, maybe got away with a couple passes there. What would you see on those? Yeah, uh, you know, one, maybe a hold, maybe not. Probably should have just thrown it elsewhere. I thought they'd call the holding and uh, one, one, one got a uh, tip ball and got made a good play. How would you assess your performance today then? I mean, it was, it was your first pick and everything. How do you yeah. feel uh, about it today? You know, there's good, there's bad. Uh, thought, I thought it went pretty well, though. We were able to get a variety of things in there, do a lot of different things, and uh, you know, come out of this with a lot of positives and a few uh, learning uh, you able to connect on those two long passes. You've got to be nice, especially you know, given that that's been something important. Yeah, yeah. Two good ones. Uh, oh, I don't know if they're both good ones. Austin's is good. The other one was a duck that uh, <laughs> someone should have shot. Uh, uh, that was it. How much better are you guys this year than last year? I guess we're, we're getting better. We got a lot of guys that came back from last year. We we're fortunate with that. And we're just trying to take the next step, the next level. A lot of guys who know what they're doing, know how to uh, play this game, and we're just trying to take the next level. How excited are you to, to be back on the move next week? It's been, been a long time, yeah. obviously. Yeah. yeah, it feels like it's been forever. Finally a home game, finally you know, sleep in your home bed before the game, all, all <laughs> that ritual, and uh, everything will be nice.